Hello, my name is Julian and welcome to this CNRL Fast Activity. Today we're going to film in slow motion. Now, we've used slow motion in our fast videos previously and there's a number of reasons why we do it. Uh, the first one is to actually see how something works or to show what's happening, to investigate why something isn't working in order for us to fix it, and of course, just for fun. In order to do this, all you're going to need is uh, an Apple or an Android smartphone or iPad um, and something you'd like to slow down, something you'd like to film in slow motion. Optional is a tripod of some description or you could just get a friend with, to hold their hands nice and steady and film it. Today I'm going to demonstrate how to do it and give you a few examples, but one of the things we're going, I'm going to show you is um, we're going to fill up a balloon with some confetti and then use a skewer to, to pierce the balloon and hopefully slow down that explosion with confetti going everywhere. All right, let's get started. So to make it easier, I've just made a sort of a paper funnel with a bit of paper and tape. So let's fill it up. So that's fairly full, I'd say about half full. Let's get rid of the rest. All right, I'll pump it up. Now that is ready to go. Okay, so we're setting up for our um, slow motion film. And as you can see, I've got my tripod set up. Um, that's optional, you can use someone with a, with a steady hand and I've got my subject ready to go. Um, I've got a, a nice plain background, which helps so you can see what's happening um, in the slow motion video. Uh, the, the other thing is you need a well lit area because the shutter speed is moving so fast to get all those frames per second, it needs to be very well lit. Okay, let's, let's get into taking the film. On your device, you'll need to find the slow motion camera option and when you've found it, hit record and pop your balloon. Now, we may need to edit the footage because you might have a very long video or it might capture the wrong bit in slow motion. So what you need to do um, in Android or iPad is go up to edit and You've got these little sliders here, which usually lets you select the part of the video that you want to slow down. So you go right up to the bit where the balloon bursts and you drag those sliders. So it's just slowing down for the part that you want. And you can also drag these sliders and it'll shorten your video. And hit done. And there we go. And of course, on the Android, you have similar options. Now, let's check out a few more ideas and have fun. How does slow motion work? Well, regular video that we take um, is usually 30 or 60 frames per second. That's 30 or 60 pictures that get put through really fast at 30 or 60 frames per second. So each second you get 60, um, pictures flash up on the screen. So what slow motion does is it'll take um, your video usually around uh, 240 frames per second. That means you can slow it to four times slower and still get that, that frame rate. Today we're going to show you how you can make your own fidget infinity cube. So for this workshop you're going to need cardboard boxes, cereal boxes are fantastic, you're going to need some tape, you're going to need a pair of scissors, and you're also going to need a pencil and a ruler so we can cut out our cubes real well. Now if you want to make a huge infinity cube that's fine, all you need is a much bigger box and much stronger tape. 